Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Jim's Magnificent Miniature Motor Cars. I'm not quite sure how many episodes we'll have put up by now, uh, but if you're a first time viewer, well, welcome. And if you've seen my other uh, episodes, you may have noticed that the bulk of the cars being reviewed or being unboxed here are from a brand called Mini GT. Well, this isn't exactly Jim's Mini GT channel, it's Jim's Magnificent Miniature Motor Car channel. That means I do other brands too. And today we'll be doing a brand that I've actually been patronizing for quite a while, but which I haven't been reviewing yet because, well, I didn't buy any last year because it's really effing expensive. But today we will feature our first ever Tomica Limited Vintage Neo Car. None other than it's Honda NSX. Check it out. Okay, there's no shrink wrap plastic to rip off today, unfortunately. Tomica doesn't do that. They just give you a lovely box. Check it out. You can actually see a small picture of the car. You have an idea of what you're getting. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay. So the packaging, as you will see, the packaging is top notch. This is an expensive car. It costs easily three times what my usual uh, Mini GT cars cost. But it comes with quite a few features. Uh, okay, so here we have the car in a very, very luxurious looking sleeve. Okay. This car, unlike Mini GT, has features like working suspension, and I think this particular model, if I'm not mistaken, has uh, me... yeah, it, it has a little, it has opening parts. I can't quite open it myself because the parts are very fine. But there we go. Yep. Yeah, okay. It has an opening. Rear window and engine compartment, and I'm terrified to break it. Anyway, um, let's have a gander at the car here. Uh, it's a magnificent specimen of. And uh, while I'm not a huge fan of this opening part, I think quite daring of Tomica to put it in. You know, and well, I I would have to recommend this to collectors, especially Honda lovers, because this car is an icon in its own right. Okay, it's it's right up there with the Porsche 911 and whatever Ferrari was in at the era. Yes, this is a very, very well-known supercar among auto enthusiasts. And this, as you can see from the pictures, is a very well-rendered car. And from this video, excuse me. So I would give this model by Tomica a, a solid 9. Not totally sold on this opening rear window. It's a little too fragile for comfort. But I would say that overall, quality, craftsmanship, etc. brings this car to a 9. And that's all for this review. And thanks so much for watching. As usual, if you like what you see, remember to give us a like and a subscribe. Thank you very much. We good?